So this is Formula Retro Racing World Tour in VR on the Oculus Quest 2. And I tried for, uh, recording this a while and it keeps, the recording just stops itself. I guess I gotta keep this short, huh? Alright. So there's only gamepad support right now. There's supposed to be uh, touch controls added later on. Just play the beginner races. Let me use the original Virtua Racing uh, car, style car, a looking car. <laughs> so yeah, this is kind of like Virtua Racing. Not as good as um, what's the game? Hot Shots Racing, but uh, worth a pickup if uh, you like that kind of old retro '90s racing, 3D racing style game. There is drifting in this game. In fact, actually, the one thing I can't stand about this game is the cars, the regular cars. They're automatic drifting, so no matter what you do, you drift. And that makes it practically impossible to play. So I hope they can update this and uh, get rid of that. Because I'm not a fan. I'm not a huge fan of that idea. And uh, it would be nice if they added uh, working side view mirrors, as well as multiplayer, although I don't know that many people would really be playing online, that's one of the problems with online multiplayer for games, especially like this. Uh, if you don't have like a mountain of people uh, playing your game, then it's kind of hard to actually uh, have a successful online multiplayer. I would like to see a quest, a full quest to port for this game. It looks like the type of game that would work on a quest 2. Um, it doesn't seem to tax any hardware whatsoever. I imagine this game could literally play on, on Celeron processing. So I'm quite sure the Quest 2 could do this. I'm cheating. Alright, so I'm going to try one more, one more uh, race because I don't want the Quest 2 to shut the recording feature off. Um, So, let's go to Paris, and I'm going to choose a different color for the same car. I think this game would do a lot better on the Quest standalone. I do find this game is easier in VR. Find a heck of a lot easier to play for whatever reason. It's simply because I can do normal behaviors like looking over my shoulder for cars or, you know, just because everything's a lot bigger 
and you can see things easier. And I can also crane my neck if I need to to see the road ahead and all that. Uh, it would be nice, actually, also, if there was some animation, like, you know, flying birds, airplanes, things like that. You have the helicopters flying overhead and all that stuff. There's not much going on in this world. I think even virtual racing had more going on. We had things like, uh, you know, what, what was it? I think there were birds and stuff. And we had that uh, Ferris wheel. I don't know if this is available for PSVR or anything like that. Uh, you know, I know it's a different game, but I almost feel like people are probably would rather just play their Gran Turismo. <laughs> um, but there, there's probably a few people, maybe like myself, who want a, want a virtual racing style game in, in Oh, I was just checking the recording indicator to make sure it was still going. Because, yeah, the last few times it just shut off and gave me a broken file. It wasn't always the best at multitasking. And we're almost there. You know, just imagine you get pulled over by the police because you friggin' smashed something or did something weird on the road. And you tell the cops, listen, you know, I was looking at the recording indicator. That's why it happened. What are you talking about? Shut up. What the hell am I talking about? I don't know. I thought I had something going there, and I did uh, going down here. You thought you were being clever, huh? Dun, dun, dun. Fuck. Shit. This guy's fault. Oh. I wanted to crash into that guy, but I finished the race. Alright, so yeah, that's that's that game running on the quest too. I feel like the resolution would be nicer. It would be nicer if the resolution was a little higher. I can raise it in the settings, but it uh, causes compression artifacts. So. The only solution to that is a wired headset, unfortunately. And I don't like wires. I never use them. If I get a wired headset, I don't use it. So. That would be why I want a Quest version. Because I don't have compression artifacts and stuff. And in some games, you end up with a nicer looking uh, view, even with the graphics settings being a little higher. Because I just hate the compression artifacts. I don't like them. <laughs>